there's another very important tool right underneath the selection tool and if you hold down on that and you go down here you'll find the cutter tool and this is a really terrific tool that lets you just any place that you want to cut something out of a drawing that you wouldn't normally be able to do with the selection tool so let me show why that is with the standard selection tool if you select a stroke it's going to select the entire stroke that you drew and in fact if your drawing happens to be flattened like we've shown before so that everything moves together then you really can't grab something you have all kinds of problems so if you just want to cut out like let's say I want to draw an ear on him so I want to cut out part of the side of his head to give me room for an ear I'll just simply cut a hole there and I can either hit the X button to delete it or and I'm going to hit undo right now or I can select that and press the cut button to cut it or I can select it again and I can just simply drag it out of the way and use it for later if for some reason it becomes important and so now if I want to draw another ear on him I'll be able to do so I just pick up my brush tool and then draw that ear and there we go now I have the wrong color basically I wanted to have it colored the same as the rest of them so I'll use this opportunity to show you how the dropper works the dropper is up here on your toolbar and that dropper will let you sample a color that I'm just going to touch on one of the colors that I want to use and that color when I hit the dropper it appears highlighted over here now and that is now the current color so what I'm going to do is use my selection tool and select that green ear and then go back over to my color palette and find the highlighted color and I'm going to tap on that and now it has made that ear the same color as the rest of him. 